After these, maybe three quests, and you have both your backpack gear and access to the final zone. Okay. Come at me with your all. I will make you kneel. Let the victor's reign be sanctioned by the blood of the fallen. I need more power. My weakness given shape! Ouch. Oh, are you kidding, dude? That's kind of hard. For them to just do it all the way back again. That completely caught me off guard. In theory, they take a while to... Uh, Explode, so I'll remain here for a little bit longer. Mm -hmm. Damn. Three stacks. Three stacks was enough for, uh, even with my shield, to kill him. I mean, I kinda knew he was going to maybe absorb a couple of, uh... Important souls or something? If oh. Turn on the oh yeah. <laughs> the worthy king. So is that him shattering his connections or something? That symbolism? There is no miracle. Is it gonna be a Tsuyomi kind of deal? You're gonna have to protect the <laughs> the memory of the kid. Is my path. I trust only in myself. Don't remember, remember this. It was 
you who failed yourself on the right to succession. I'm not gonna let that go, dude. I'm not gonna let that go. It looks like a... It looks like a Power Rangers villain. I don't know what that is. Ah. Okay, now I know what that is. Okay, this one's gonna be outside, so we'll go inside. Okay. I mean, that much was obvious. They often do things this way. Small arena, don't fall. Uh, watch behind. Sink. Oh, I see. Or I think I see. Oh, it was the opposite. Okay. Wait, what? He oh. The one that you have to look at. Ah, okay. Thank you. I didn't even see that there was a second. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Yeah, I thought it was just the one behind me, and that was a. Ah, I see. Uh. Forged tracker. Okay. Hey. I don't know. Something hit me? What? Okay. So... Here? No. Just, it's hard to pay attention to. Uh, yeah. That one's gonna be there, okay. That one's gonna be there, okay. I think he's still fine.
Okay. The right and the top. Yep. I'm I'm looking. Uh oh. Yeah, those are very difficult to see. Mm -mm -mm Okay, here we go. Mm. Oh. Um. Brother. Man, that is like, and his voice is like spicy loud. Um. Understand why it had to be this way. Why don't I know you? Why didn't you want me? 
How could I be a father when my own spared me? He left me nothing. No throne. No legacy. Nothing. And so, I had nothing to leave you. Like you see, like as you can see in this cutscene, he he looks like he has the body of a two-headed mamoja. But then you have the only the head on the left, sorry, the head on the right, which is the head of resolved. But where there should be a head of reason, there isn't any. What did I say? What did I what did I tell you? You cannot reason somebody out of an idea they did not reason themselves into. He is stupid. Like, you're the one who chose to live nothing. Like, just because you can't be a king or whatever, like, you already decided to have that stupid goal of yours to begin with. Like, uh, whatever. Continue, please. By all means, tell me. Why does that matter? Couldn't you have just been there? Sweat of your brow, sure. And what is it that you accomplished that is so good? Oh, oh, oh my god. The, the only reason why this is seen as emotion is because of the kid. Because I, I... I only see... I only see a guy on the floor right now that is in the brink of death who is now maybe realizing that, you know... That now maybe, just maybe, having a couple of lucid thoughts before death. That's all I see. Maybe. I walked the path of ruin. Unable to surpass father. You think Papa left you nothing? You God's damned fool! You have the one thing he couldn't leave anyone else. You and Kulucha. Oh, the key. So, well, let me just wait because they're probably going to start talking in a second there. It's not over. 
I'll, I'll, I'll conclude my line of thought in a little bit. Soroja is gone. There's no need to fight anymore. Sveen? Why are you here? I wanted to express my gratitude to you all for vanquishing the King of Resolve and delivering my people. And to express my regret for what I've done to yours. Your apologies won't bring back our dead or lessen your guilt. Still, to strike you down in revenge would trigger all-out war between our nations. More innocents would suffer. Even if we cannot be friends right now, we need to find a different path forward. A way that Tulihyolal and Alexandria can coexist. I fear that can never be. What do you mean? There is no other path for us. It's too late. I cooperated with Zeralja because I needed the life force yielded by the slain to sustain the Endless. Of course, the King betrayed me, and with his army defeated, that plan can no longer be realized. But I can't, I won't fail my people. Be they possessed of flesh or no, all of them are dear to me. If there is something I can do for them, as their queen, I must do it. Sveen, we appreciate your commitment to serving the Alexandrians and have endeavoured to understand your beliefs. Be that as it may, you must know it's wrong to sacrifice our living to save your dead. I see. It's because you do not know them that you believe they're dead. They're not. So long as they are remembered, they shall never die. You understand, don't you? No matter what anyone may say, I refuse to believe that Kafkiwa's is a hollow existence, that she can simply be allowed to fade away. I am the bearer of the memories of Queen Sveen of Alexandria, and my desire to protect my people transcends all others. For them, I will do anything. No price is too high. Seven hells. Ah. 
What is it? There exists a legend in Alexandria. In ages past, faced with a calamity in their world, a clan of people used a singular power to flee to ours. The key which manifests this power answers to fervent desires. Desperate, all-consuming supplications that have given rise to many a miracle. That key holds the secret to interdimensional fusion and unraveling its mysteries was the foremost mission of the scientists of preservation. Alas, they failed to fully grasp its workings, leaving us with only partial control over it. Nevertheless, if I'm to sustain the inhabitants of living memory, I have no choice but to call upon its power. And do what with it? For hundreds of years I tried, but it was all to no avail. My benevolence did naught to protect my realm. But I can still take up arms and fight. If bloodshed will save my subjects, then I will become history's most brutal queen. Did she, like, take all the souls with her or something? So, what I wanted to say about the... Um Zoralgia and you know the sun and stuff. That's exactly why here in the real world we have you know shows like um, you know Fresh Prince of Bel Air. It's like they're comedy, like you know Family Matters, like they're comedy. But you know it's all about you know that those family values and stuff, right? They don't have that in Tulio, so they 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 didn't know. They didn't know. <laughs> 